welcome back to our channel. Today, we'll be discussing the surprising turn in the relationship between Donald Trump and Ron DeSantis, and how it could impact the GOP's chances in the upcoming election. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful, conservative content. Lately, it seems that there's something about Ron DeSantis that's really getting under Donald Trump's skin. Once allies and friends, the two men appear to have hit a rough patch, with Trump becoming increasingly fixated on DeSantis and his policies. In a recent early morning post on Truth Social, Trump lashed out at DeSantis, coming off as somewhat unhinged. Some have even started to call it DeSantis derangement syndrome. Or DDS, the truth is, DeSantis would only be a threat to Trump for the GOP nomination if it were a head-to-head -head competition, which it won't be. Ironically, anti-Trumpers who believe they can save the world from Trump are actually helping him get nominated. If they genuinely wanted him to lose, they would unite behind one candidate, persuade others not to run, and allow that person to go head-to-head -head with Trump. Trump craves admiration, but many people seem to like DeSantis more than they like Trump. Rather than forming a super ticket with DeSantis, Trump decided to attack him, likening him to a wheelchair over the cliff kind of guy just like his supposed hero, failed politician Paul Ryan. Trump doesn't seem to realize that his behavior is alienating the pundits who have backed him since 2016, and some diehard Trump supporters are now spewing venom at DeSantis supporters. While Trump may secure the nomination, he could face difficulties in the general election. The rift between Trump and DeSantis is perplexing, considering their history as allies and friends. It's uncertain whether Trump's attacks on DeSantis will persist, but his fixation on him is undeniably causing unnecessary drama within the Republican Party. While Trump may still secure the GOP nomination, it's possible that his behavior could hurt him in the general election. In the end, the Republican Party needs unity, not division, if they want to emerge victorious. We'll be keeping a close eye on the situation between Trump and DeSantis, so stay tuned for more updates. That's it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more politics insights. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.